Shalom, shalom, man. In today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to make goat jerky. Got the smoker preheating, got my uh, my goat meat marinating, and uh, stay tuned. another episode so today what i got here right here is some goat meat um fresh butchered that we raised on this property and uh pretty much it's been marinating in some red peppers some teriyaki and a little sugar and uh definitely looks tender it looks like it's been softened up and got tenderized pretty good so we're gonna put some of this on there on the uh the smoker so stay tuned. All right, got the smoker preheating. And uh, I'm gonna go ahead and put, put this on there. Layer it on there real thin sheets, real thin slivers like that. And I got this bad boy on 300. So this won't take long at all. We have some good goat jerky because all of those scraps off of the goat you know, you don't want to throw away and you want to get the most use for it. So I figure I'll make me some goat jerky out of it because uh, beef jerky is expensive, very expensive. But we gonna get this joker in there and this will be some good, good eating. We, ain't, we don't want to waste none of this. You have something, you'd be surprised how much meat you can get off some of them scraps off the goat that most people would just throw away. And we're gonna put all that in there. Real nice light. See that smoke coming up off of there now? So we almost in there. Mm-hmm. This is my first time trying this, man, you know. If I do this and I'm able to get a deer this year, I'll make me some venison jerky. Yep, sure will. We ain't gonna waste nothing because we spent a good bit of money raising these goats. So we wanna get the most yield that we can. We'll have a good smoky flavor. Shouldn't take long. I'm gonna see how two hours lets it look. And then we will go from there. And I already see that smoke coming out of there. Raw meat probably started out raw weight with about three pounds worth of scrap meat meat that a lot of people probably would have uh, not known what to do with. And I said, hey man, ain't got nothing to lose. Worst case scenario, it don't come out good and you eat it, you know. Eat it with a little rice, something like that, and hey, you, you're good to go. But my wife likes beef jerky, so hopefully um, she really is not a fan of goat meat because, uh, you know, it's raised on the land. But if all goes well, man, this will be a great introduction for somebody that uh, normally is like, man, I ain't messing with no goat meat. You know, I'm an advocate for, hey, if you ain't got no food, the goat meat gonna start looking real good. Hopefully all them seasons took in there pretty good. It's been marinating for about 24 hours. come back check on this in a little bit see what we looking like man stay encouraged Israel stay encouraged man stay encouraged as 
we enter in these last days, man. I'm just learning how to try to live off the land to the best of my ability. You know, raising your own food and meat. One thing I know about this, about this goat meat, is I don't have to worry about any chemicals or anything because I know what's in it. I know what I fed it. You know, so don't have to worry about any of this mystery meat going around. You can count on your, you know, your own farming. Lay that all in there. We're gonna let that smoke get in there good. Yes, sir. If I can get a nice little Ziploc bag, gallon Ziploc bag full of jerky that uh, we can snack on, man, that'll be all right. Nice, healthy snack full of protein, good nutrients. Our goats eat uh, just a basic grain, hay, and uh, goat feed. They like that alfalfa, that alfalfa grass. Nice little pieces of scrap meat right there. We ain't wasting none of that. Not the way we eat around here, not the way these boys like to eat, man, and growing hay. Let me sit this down, and uh, next time we come back, we'll be taking a good look at it, see how it's doing. Got it on 300. Stay tuned. All right, we back at it. That's the finished product right there. That good old goat jerky. Let's check a piece of that out right there. Let's see what we got. Been out there working. Look at that right there. Good old goat jerky. Mm-hmm. Let's check this out. Hold on. Here we have it right here. Good old goat jerky. Mm. A little sweet. Like teriyaki. Got a little spice to it. That's pretty good right there. Look at that. Real tender. Cooked it on... Uh, I did about 200 for two hours and I put it on 350 for the last hour cooked all the way through it's good good way to use that scrap meat that you don't uh, normally want to use or you would throw away good right there so there you have it man that's my goat jerky recipe